guys, it's Jackie. I hope you guys are doing well. The weekend is come to an end. By the time you see this video, it will be Monday afternoon. I am doing this video in collaboration with my friends over at Our Fun Circus. They are a very hilarious family out in upstate New York. Um, they do daily vlogs and they also uh, hunt Ray Dunn. So this video is going to be some of my favorite Ray Dunn pieces. Um, we had talked about doing a video where it was a shop with me, but I have never done a shop with me and I'm not quite comfortable filming out in public. So I said, why don't we do like our favorite Ray Dunn pieces? So um, Clarissa agreed with me. So you have to go over and check them out. They are on Our Fun Fam or Our Fun Circus. Sorry, I'm ton tongue tied. Nothing new, right? If you watch my channel, you know that I get all my words mixed up. Um, and I will link them down below, but this is a collaboration with them today. So please, if you come from their channel, say hello, tell us who you are. Welcome to my channel. And if you go over there, tell her that Jackie sent you, um, to their channel. But I have to tell you that Charlie, their middle daughter is my spirit child. I love that kid. She is hysterical. When you watch their videos, when Zach goes to drop him off at school, she never wants to go to school. I noticed the last couple, she kind of is excited about it. And and then Sam's not, but you definitely have to check out their videos. So without further ado, I will show you some of my favorite Ray Dunn pieces. This is in no particular order. Um, a couple, one item, actually two items are new to me, but I was looking for one of them. Um, it's kind of like my unicorn, but I wanted to show you this first one. I filmed or filmed, I framed this is part of a notebook. I liked the word faith and I wanted to put it in like this collage area when you first walk into my home. So I cut this out from the notebook and I framed it and I just love it. So this is not a piece that you can buy like this. Um, you can do what I did and cut it out and frame it. So that is one of my favorite pieces that I put together. So when you come into my home, I've kind of got like a... Um, a couple of different, almost like a gallery wall, but not really. There's a family picture and some other things. And then I know I have talked about these, but I love Ray Dunn's ink pens. And this one says write, and it's got the stylus on the end. Um, I like it. I like how they write. I like the way that they feel. Um, it's not too heavy and it's not light, but I wanted to show you guys, um, it says right in three different places around the ink pen. I have a few pens, but this is like one of my favorites. I wanted to show you guys that. One of my newer items that I was super, super excited to find, I just hauled this a couple weeks ago. It says T and it's a little canister. You can see I don't have anything in it. I don't really drink tea, but I liked it on my counter. I set it next to my Stir Crazy utensil holder. So this is one of my favorite pieces because it's super tiny and I just like the way it looks. And I am looking for the pour picture that says iced tea. Um, I haven't seen it out in the wild yet. That's what I call when you go to a store and you can find Ray Dunn on your own. Um, but that is one of my favorite pieces. This I have in my bathroom, um, in our bedroom, and it's the soap dispenser that says clean. This was one of the pieces that I was trying to find and I couldn't find it anywhere. Um, I finally found it at a Marshall's um, and it was $9.99. I didn't take the sticker off yet. There is soap in it. Um, I think it's a Bath and Body Works soap. Yeah, it's Comfort by Bath and Body Works. It's one of the aromatherapy. Um, but I couldn't find one of these and then I finally found one. And for whatever reason, like the... Um, the pump wasn't screwing into it uh, properly, so I ended up returning it, and my cousin Jamie found this for me, um, so I did get it again. It's my second one. I didn't show you this one. I showed you the original one that I hauled, and then she did just bring this to me, um, but I don't know why, but I just love this one. It's like really off-centered. Um, one thing about me is that I do like to clean. It's a very therapeutic and there's something about it. Um, I just like living in a tidy home. My mom always taught us that you should keep your house as if Jesus were going to come and knock on your door and come into your home, which is really funny because if you grew up Christian, um, Jesus is in your heart. So mom, I got a bone to pick with you one day when I get to talk to you again. 
took me a while to come up with that one. But this is one of my newer items. I don't have anything in it yet, but it is a picture frame. And it says, this is us. And I want to put a picture of Joe and I in here. It's kind of funny because I was just talking about this episode, this TV show that's on right now. I can't watch it because it makes me cry. And I don't want to sit there and watch a TV show that I cry every, every single week. I, I just, I'm not about it. I cry. I'm very sensitive. And to if you watch that show, you'll have to let me know in the down bar below or in the comments below. I was telling my friend um, in South Carolina, I was telling her I like to watch Love After Lockup, and I told you guys that last week. Now, that's a show that I'm not going to cry about, but the show This Is Us, oh my god, tearjerker. But anyways, I finally found this picture frame. I'm going to put this in our living room um, once I get a good picture of Joe and I. That is a new piece, but it, I was looking for a picture frame. I don't remember... There were a couple of different versions and I saw that one finally out in the wild and I picked it up because I was like, oh my gosh, I want to put a picture of Joe and I in there. Now, a couple of my mugs that are my favorited is this one. It says blessed. Um, I just like it because that's how I feel. I feel extremely blessed to be alive and so I keep this one right here in this room where I'm sitting. Actually, most of my mugs are in this room. But that is one of my most favorited one. And then because I'm a huge Disney fan and we're getting ready to go again um, in the summer, I found these, I want to say on a Facebook group, I believe a couple of weeks ago. And I like it because it's beauty and beast. So it's not really beauty and the beast, but it, it's a Disney themed, you know, obviously you know what they're implying. Um, it's my... One of my most favorite Disney cartoon is Beauty and the Beast, the original and the new motion picture video or DVD that came out last year. Was it last year or the year before? I don't know. I like it all. Um, it is like, I don't, there's just something about the, the whole um, Disney Beauty and the Beast, the original cartoon. I just like the songs in it. And so when I saw this, I'm like, I have to have these because, you know, like I said, I'm a huge Disney fan. It's no surprise. Olaf is my absolute favorite. And speaking of Disney, my Scentsy Buddy is coming this week. So I'll have to, I'll do a video on that. And then my last most favorited piece is also another new one that I had been looking for. And I did finally, oh, I thought I was going to knock my light over. I did finally actually cook in one of my pieces and I then I hand washed it. I didn't put it in my dishwasher, even though I do think they say dishwasher safe. They do, but I don't want it to ruin. This is my newest piece and one of my favorite. Oh, we didn't do a thumbnail. You like that? Um, that's for my niece Bella. She knows. So this one says made with love and it's one of the bigger ones. Um, it was $19.99 and I did get this at my home goods. Um, I just thought that was really cool because even if you weren't sure if you wanted to get a gift some, for somebody like a housewarming gift or a bridal shower gift or something, or if somebody is sick or you want just to take them, you know, something homemade. I think it would be really cool, like, if you made them something, put it in here, and then said, you know, when you're done, the dish is yours. And so then when they go to look at the bottom of the dish, it says made with love. I don't know. It's just really cool. So I finally got to pick this up. I love it. I think it's really, really neat. I like, you know, all the sayings of Ray Dunn. I think they're very uplifting. They're positive. Um, a lot of the pieces are, you know very uplifting. The one I'm looking for is the home sign that says, let's stay home. That's what I really, really want. But I hope you guys are doing well. I wanted to share this video with you. Some of my favorite Ray Dunn pieces. Tell us in the comments below what your favorite piece is. And if you're coming over from our friends at our fun circus, please say hello and let us know. Subscribe, um, hit the notification bell if you like, and thumbs up the video. Welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you have a great week and I will talk to you soon. Bye!